Let's see if we can't wall drag this. Oh, that's a little more than a wall. Oh, that's a little more than a wall drag. Oof. Hello, everybody, and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Beam NG at to Model Land, and we're actually in a Supra. So we're gonna go out and get the Supra drifting. If you guys want to know what mod this actually is. Hirachi Prashu. So this is a mod that I have installed. We're going to be getting this basically down to downloading and we're also going to be doing some tuning on it. So make sure you guys follow me and also show me all the in the description box below. Let's get to it. So with this Supra, it does have a lot of different um, aspects with it and a lot of pre-built cars, but I'm actually going to do the stock left-hand drive one. We're going to replace our current car. And we're going to go from basically tuning this left-hand drive Supra and make it drift. So we're going to turn off DSC. And we're going to go full set. And it's stock first. We're not going to do any type of uh, testing other than, oh, it's got an open diff. So we're definitely going to need to change the diff, but we're going to try and get some drifting in it. Okay, well, overall not too shabby. I thought it wasn't going to drift at all. Oh, oh, we blew a tire. Apparently you're not supposed to cut across that part of the track. Uh, okay. So one thing we definitely need to adjust for sure. is we need to make the diff not so open. So we're gonna go and go into the vehicle configuration, go body, and we're gonna go down to suspension, rear differential. We're gonna go with a limited slip. We're gonna add the limited slip, and then of course we're going to go to front suspension, and we are gonna add the quick ratio drift steering on the car. And that's all we're gonna add to start. Oh, grinding gears. So we have now an LSD and a quick drift steering ratio. And now it feels much better already. Very spongy though, because of the super soft suspension. But overall, not too terrible with just that. Um, I kind of like it. Oh my god. So I thought this was going to be way harder. Oh, I almost lost it. Now we do probably need to get a little more power. Maybe uh, adjust that suspension a little bit because this is very uh, spongy. I thought we were going to tap the wall there. Oh, not enough luck. We need to adjust that suspension, I think. That is a little bit too soft, but... We can't break grab the ender. I'm actually thoroughly impressed with this. Oh, as I say that, we almost lose it. Nope. <laughs> so let's do a little bit of suspension. You can configure, I should pop the thing into neutral. And let's go into front suspension. And let's do race front coilovers. And then in rear suspension, we're gonna do race rear coilovers. So that already kind of dropped us down a lot. Um, I think we're gonna leave all of that. Let's go to the engine and see if we can't get... We don't want to add a turbo yet. Uh, I think we could just add a uh, dual exhaust. Give ourselves a little bit more power maybe. Now we'll keep the stock exhaust on there. I hope I can see the pedals. We can add a little power to it if we want to, but we're not going to do that yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to change up we're going to change up the wheels. 
And we're going to put something uh, a bit better on there. We are 16, so let's do... What are we? 16 by 8. So let's do... 17 by... 17 by 9s? We'll do 17 by 9s, and then we need to add... Let's do drift tires in the front. 245, 35, 17 drift tires. Oh boy, those are really big. And I don't know if that's actually going to work right. But we're going to find out. Rear, we're going to go to the 17x9s. 17 by 9s We'll throw gray ones in the back. We're going to plop. Oh, different ones. The Volk TEs. Ah, okay. We're uh, doing some full j changes here. 17 by... Alright, so now we got... Definitely clipping through the fender. So we're going to need to go to tuning. We're going to need to raise the front suspension. And track width, we'll leave. We'll leave that. We'll leave that. Suspension. Front ride height. Raise that ride height up. That's a little bit probably too much. And then we'll raise the rear up a little bit. We're going to apply that. Uh, rear needs to go up a little more. We're kind of monster trucking this with these wheels, but we're going to see how this drives. We got drift tires on it now. And some race suspension. Some big wheels, not a proper size at all. But overall, not too bad. Oh, a little bit too much snap back there. Let's see if we can't wall drag this. Oh, that's a little more than a wall. Oh, that's a little more than a wall drag. Oof. All right, so let's change up the wheels a little bit more. Not really liking the configuration of these front wheels. They're a little bit too big, I think. So I think we're going to go back to the fronts. I think we should probably stick with... Maybe just 17 by 8. Those are not as wide. We'll try the 17 by 8 RX7 wheels and see if that actually does anything. 17 by... Oh, there is no 17 by 8 RX7 wheels. Well then. I guess we're just going to throw some uh, 17 by 9s in the rear. Oh, I actually like those wheels. So we're going to put those on the fronts too. Eh, we'll do drift. We'll do this drift style. So we're going to go back to tuning. We're going to go and actually lower right high of the rear a little bit, right high of the front a little bit, get it not so high on the ground. Not so high off the ground. We need to uh, shrink the front track with. We can shrink that a lot more. Try not to be super aggressively poked because then we can lower the front and then we're going to lower the rear track with. There we go. Now we can go back and we can lower it. Uh, spring rate. Let's go down and go down and see where that puts us. All right, that's a lot better. All right, so now let's see how this does. Get back behind. So overall, just having a lot of fun here on Beam NG. Getting the Supra to drift on a factory motor, basically. Apparently, we had, didn't have as much enough grip as I thought. So it just goes true. You don't need a lot of power in this game to drift.
but apparently my steering angle is not going to help. So let's add a little more power because we know that's bound to happen. Let's go to the engine and let's add... Let's add the intake. Let's add stage one twin turbo. With... Uh, what's daddy's exhaust all right we'll do that uh we'll do stage two turbo we'll just go straight up there in the power guess we're grinding out the gears way more power did not think we needed to go that high We were definitely driving way better with lower power. Okay. Can't wall tap that. So we were driving better on stock power, but let's take a look real quick at some of the tweaked mods of this. As you can see, we got a whole bunch, a slew of Supras from race to drift to interceptors, all kinds of things. Walmart. Oh boy. Well, we're going to do that one. Just because to end this episode off. If you guys enjoyed this, if you guys want to keep seeing more, let me know down in the comment section down below. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Um <laughs> Apparently This is a drag car. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so, I think... Uh, I think we need to send this car flying super high. So, we're going to change maps real quick. And we're going to go to... Motorsports Playground. Just because I feel like we need to send that thing skywards to end this episode off. Because it's BMNG. We got to do some crashing stuff. So let's do that. We'll load in and then we'll let, send this thing sailing to end this episode off. So we spawned ourselves into the quick into the quick travel, into the jump section. We're going to pull that car out again. But just because this car seems like it's going to be a lot of fun just trying to hit this jump. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll the description box below. Let's get to it. Oh, I can't even get grip. I mean, Supers are meant to fly, right? <laughs> so that'll do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys. Oh my god, on the track. Oh, that's bad. I don't know how the engine's still running.